have the box out tons of pillows I honestly don't know what's in here but we just need to put it all over the room because we're looking very unspirited right Piper we've got the yola going we have my new balsam candle going it smells so good what is it Fraser fur and we're just we're ready to get in the spirit my room is so clean ignore the fact that my pictures still are not nailed in haven't gotten that done but I don't care we're not letting anything else distract us or prolong us putting up our decorations it just needs to happen right now Let it snow, let it snow. I'm so excited because I forgot that I bought these at Target last year. They're a lot cuter once I fluff them up, but wow, I, I was surprised. Also, I don't know if you can see this, but the amount of glitter I just got on my bed from that is horrific. And now it's going on the floor, I know, but I need a sweep now. I'm so happy we're finally decorated. We got the little reef. I added fa la 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 la, that little snowflake. And it just looks so cozy in here now, especially when my little what is it called? I always forget the name of it. Garland. Once the lights actually turn on, they twinkle. It is beautiful, magical. And then the pillows really just add it. I have the candle. The U-Log makes everything. I'm just so happy. Also, look it. Turn the lights off. <gasps> beautiful. Wow. Okay, I found my annual reindeer antlers. My lopsided reindeer antlers. <laughs> also, I think I'm going to wear these today. My lights that I had. Put them on and not... Okay, bad idea for putting on the antlers first. Eee, so cute. I look very, very festive. I've been in these pajamas nonstop all December and honestly also November. But tonight, hello, happy Vlogmas Day 9. What the heck, I haven't even started the vlog. I feel so in the spirit now. I'm so happy, especially I hope I can find someone to bring me batteries. No one's responding to me. I'm going to maybe call my mom. Okay, I don't think I'm wearing these tonight. Anyways, I have not started off the vlog this late so far. It is 6.30 my bad on that one but tonight's gonna be so much fun i have a few friends coming over and we're doing like i saw this on tiktok it's like a holiday cocktail night and everyone's supposed to bring like their own cocktail present it presentation counts we want to make it cute aesthetic and we serve it to people we all rate it it should be really fun that's why i wanted to get my room in the holiday spirit it was not it was feeling very bland yes i just painted it i'm so happy so now that that's done i wanted to get it fully together and i'm obsessed Finally, why did I wait so long? I don't know. Let's go show you what's going on. Okay, so my drink for tonight is actually spiked hot cocoa. We have to have it. So I just went and picked up this Bailey's. It is light, so it's a little bit less sugar and also calories, so that's amazing. And I have whipped cream. You know, presentation matters, so I'll show you guys, but I'm obsessed with these little clear mugs i'm gonna do something cute with that also take a moment for my gingerbread house it's still here and then for the best part of hosting making a cheese board i'm so excited we have all the necessities we got brie parmesan jalapeno olives um yeah we decided we're gonna add a few cookies on the charcuterie board i don't know how we're gonna do this but also we got triscuits a few grapes both of these boards they're not very festive at all but i couldn't find our other boards they're both from hawaii so probably actually gonna do the charcuterie here and then maybe like the sweets on this one take off these bowls i think that'd be cute we're gonna get started on this board first because i just want to snack on it i just realized i didn't have dinner yet i threw some kale noki in the air fryer but i'm so hungry okay parmesan i never know what to do with it because it's in such a weird shape we're just gonna wing it i love parmesan yes i'm allergic to dairy if you didn't know but i can't say no to cheese sometimes like charcuterie boards get me every time we need a bigger board nope we need a bigger board i thought i was gonna make a mini board today no there is no such thing as a mini charcuterie board i found the one this isn't even the biggest one we have but the other one, there was a bunch of stuff on it. Okay, one thing I learned that I didn't know before about brie is you're supposed to warm it up. I, I guess I never ate brie before, honestly, but you're supposed to warm it up. I put it in for 60 seconds, so it's a little bit soft. Maybe it needs a little more, I don't know. But then the key is apparently to put honey on it 
Thank God I got a brand new thing of honey. And then you can put honey over it, walnuts, cranberries. I just like honey because I'm, I don't like nuts on, I don't know. I don't like walnuts that much. Now it's time to add the olives, everything, and make it, you know, aesthetic. Okay, this is what we're looking like so far. Emily has a few more things that we can add in. They're actually like sweet treats. We're gonna put these away since this was big enough. But this is all the jalapeno olives I had. Not that many, but I love charcuterie boards. They're just so cute. This is my tip. Always keep your cheese containers because you usually don't finish it. At least we don't. The girls are here and I said they're not allowed in my door unless they're in pajamas. So let's see. Did they listen to me? Cute! They listen. You're in pajamas. Okay, the girls are here. Okay, Olivia is the first one. She's hiding her drink behind the bag. While she does that, I'm snacking on the charcuterie board because I'm actually not gonna eat my gnocchi. This oh, is my okay. dinner, and I'm not mad because this is way better. I'm gonna need you guys to all turn around. What? What? Oh, here we go. <laughs> it's all about the experience. So this is Peppermint bark rum chata with vodka. Oh. Peppermint and a rosemary leaf inside. Wow. And with sugar. Wow. Very cute. Very creative. Rosemary. Did you, actually, <laughs> did you find this recipe? Mm -hmm. Very good, my mom. Mm. And I also crushed up peppermint, really which you'll good. see inside your drink. Okay, we gave you for presentation. We gave you a 9.7 for taste. Mm -hmm. We gave you an 8. Okay, that's good. It's good. I'll just explain why. Does anyone want to explain? It's delicious. It's delicious, yeah. But it's just peppermint orange. <laughs> With vodka, bud. With vodka. <laughs> Okay, Emily's drink has amaretto. Oh, it smells good. It's like it's like a cherry. Piercing my nose. Yeah, I've, yeah. I've never had it. You have to taste just the, it by itself first. And when she makes you drink, you get a uh, Oh, it's good. Is it really? What the heck? I love it. So good. I'm a fan, I'm a fan. Whatever this is. Okay. Almond, I don't like almond either, that's weird. Wow, Emily's drink looks beautiful. I'm excited. She made a sugar cookie drink with colorful sprinkles. That's the Yay. energy I need. Yay. Okay. okay, cheers, everyone. And there's icing that keeps the sprinkles up. All right. What the frick? <laughs> it has three different liquors. What? Oh, I thought you were to say three shots, right? <laughs> This is our creator. I got off the website. Look at her mm. face. I can definitely taste the amaretto though. Mm -hmm. And it's supposed to be whole milk, but obviously you use whole milk. Thank that you. Milk. Yeah, that'll that, make a difference. That could have, yeah. Creativity, I give you a thousand percent. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's only out of ten. <laughs> <laughs> For the taste, I'll give it like a, a five. Maybe a four. It's not a sugar cookie yeah. when you were. Does yours taste like this? No, it doesn't. I don't want to taste it again. <laughs> I spent so much money on this, <laughs> too. Okay, so Emily's score is a seven. That's only two points below Bia. Naya. Okay, everyone. This is my spice hot chocolate. You already saw me making it, so I'm really only explaining it for the vlog. It's Bailey's chocolate almond milk. Vanilla, whipped cream, hot cocoa, whatever. Let's get all the alcohol mixed. Okay, we're on drink number three, AKA my spiked hot chocolate. I think it's the best so far. But maybe I'm biased because I love hot chocolate. And I was too hot to even vlog anymore. Like I had to go outside. So we're gonna get everyone's rating because we forgot to rate mine. Yeah. Nine for presentation. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, you could just. You I'll take it. Done a little bit better, like um, a, uh, like your mom put the gingerbread the cookie. Gingerbread would have. Well, she had I didn't want a gingerbread cookie. cookie. Okay. okay, everyone go on taste. Taste, I would give it a ten. Ten? Mm -hmm. Oh my God! What does that mean? What's my score? That means you have a nine point five. Nine point five, baby. Oh. I have a nine point five. Bia's a nine, and Emily has a seven. Oh, eight. 
I tried really hard because you we looked up recipes together and you chose gingerbread and I chose this hey, one and then you changed okay, it hey, last mom. minute. Listen, we should we should have put a category on the difficulty of it. Of it. We cannot so go next, back now. Next year, next year, the difficulty of it. <sighs> drink number four, aka last drink of the night. Looks beautiful. I'm. I don't know what is it, mom. Maybe you have to explain it. It is it down our down classic coquito for the season. Ooh, coquito. coquito. Okay, I know what coquito tastes like, but ten out of ten. <laughs> you actually like coquito? Yeah. Have you had it before? Okay. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. We all love Coquito. Now who would we say won? <laughs> Titi and Nish, and then me, and then you. Bia is so, I'm so bitter sorry. that I got a better she score than got her. You got a higher score. You got 9.5? Yeah, and you got a 9. No, I, I didn't decide on that one number. Creativity. Not me ending the vlog the next day again. Emily did indeed sleep over. We haven't had a sleepover in so long. It felt like we were back in high school in our matching PJs, watching a movie and eating junk food. What did we watch? Love Heart? Yeah. But it was so cute. I love movies like that. And we're not hungover, guys, because we honestly actually didn't drink that much. We just mixed a lot. Yeah. But we had like little sample cups and we didn't even finish them so it was good highly recommend with your friends because it was very unique and creative and fun it was on the wrong setting and that's why we were blurry say bye vlog okay bye